Hey, in this video I will show you how to add particles to your 360 photos. So I've uploaded this 360 photo that we've taken with the Ricoh Theta S camera to our site 360visor.io. In 360visor.io it's really easy to just uh, drag and drop your 360 photos in and share them with your friends. Let's click on the photo to reveal the menu. On the top right corner we have some buttons and the middle one there is an edit button and we can use that to launch Visor's editor and from Visor's editor we can add cool stuff to the photo. So this photo was taken with Ricoh Theta S camera and, and that camera is a monoscopic camera so it doesn't really have any stereo depth in the photos. But what we, what we can do in Visor, we can add particles which do have stereo depth on top of it to achieve a pretty cool effect when you look at it in VR. So let's hit tab to show the graph. In Visor, uh, the way you edit the scene and change the parameters is using this uh, node graph. So on the patches menu on the left here, I have a folder called particles. I'll open it and click and drag the particle emitter preset to the scene here and just connect it to the scene like this, clicking and dragging. And just like that, we have particles on top of our photo. As you can see, they are everywhere around us. So let's hit the tab again to show the graph. And you'll notice the particle emitter subgraph has this edit button, the, the, the pencil. Let's click it. And here we have all the different parameters to change the appearance of our particles. First of all, they're pretty big, so I'll just change the, the size to be a lot smaller. For example, 0 0.1. And let's give them a bit more lifetime. Here we can change parameters like particle count, the speed, spawn rate, spread, noise. Here's the direction of the particles and the gravity settings. And from here, clicking the edit button, you can change the, the image of the particle. And transparent PNG files work the best here. Scrolling down a bit, here we have some settings to change the color and opacity of the particles. So let's change the color. I'll just make the luminosity a bit down to make them darker. And change the hue to make them yellow. So here we are, that's pretty cool. And of course, as always, when you're done, you can just hit publish. And of course, for publishing, you have to register or sign up as a Visor user to publish. Thank you for watching and have fun playing with particles.